Hi, I'm Rod Smith. I'm British, but I live in France, in Provence. Uh, this is my third time judging the Balkans International Wine Competition and Festival. It's uh, fantastic to be back, especially with such amazing weather in Sofia. Uh, we saw uh, more than 800 entries, I think, including some fantastic wines. Great progression from previous years, wine quality and style. And what a marvelous uh, festival of wine for Sofia in the beginning of summer. Cheers. The very wealthy people of the Roman Empire, and probably prior to that, showed off how rich they were to us, and it came on horses. It was a hugely expensive thing to do. So back then, the only form of remuneration was ice and they could have fresh meat. Am I making sense? Yeah. So where's the place in France that makes white wine from black grapes? It's Champagne. Most of the grapes grown in Champagne are black grapes, 60% black grapes. But they do this gentle pressing thing and get pink juice or white juice from black grapes. So the people in Provence decided to do that. We'll make a white wine from our black grapes and we'll sell it for more money and we'll, we'll be alright. This pink, I mean, just a tiny amount. Uh, the colour is uh, a small part of it. Doesn't that taste like a serving of rock, doesn't it? It's an interesting way of selling serving of rock. We've got serving of rock rosé, because rosé is suddenly fantastically popular. So you don't need a lot. Yes. The name of the wine. Perret is a dark kind of rose, it's quite good with some of the local food, but difficult to sell. Uh, and in uh, Italy they have uh, Pieretto as well, Bardolino Pieretto, which is specifically to go with some of the fish from the lake. Uh, which is again, the, the grape varieties for Bardolino are quite purple. 